The Murray Board of Education is proposing a bond measure in this year's election to address concerns in two of its schools. The board wants to rebuild Riverview Junior High School and also wants to build a new classroom wing and add security enhancements at Murray High School. But as ABC4's Yunsen Kim shows us now, all of that comes at a price. Leaky roofs, faulty faucets, and old classrooms. Riverview Junior High School is really getting up there in years. Built when JFK was in office, this school needs a makeover, according to a district official. If you were to go underneath the bowels of the school, you would see that the plumbing was from the 1960s and is time for it to be replaced as well. There's a lot of leaks. There's a lot of uh, things that just aren't up to code, up to standards that we need to have for students uh, in this day and age. Yeah. The Murray City School District is hoping to build a whole new Riverview Junior High in the empty lot behind the school. It's also planning to add a new wing to Murray High School to house all the new students. It's done its service to the community and has uh, lived the life that it can live. Um, it, it is time for it to be replaced entirely. It's but it needs $125 million and it's going to cost the taxpayers. An average Murray dweller may have to pay around $11 more a month. So in the ballots mailed out tomorrow, voters are going to have a choice. Nobody wants to see their taxes go up, but we also know that our community is very invested in, their edu in the education of our students. They care about our kids. ABC4's Jensen Kim.